screen and mirror any Apple iPhone to any TV possible on this planet Earth without Wi-Fi. And to prove this to you, I'm gonna show you that I am not connected to any Wi-Fi. And as you can see, I have put my iPhone on airplane mode just to prove it to you that it is actually live right now. I am not connected to any Wi-Fi. It's pretty smooth and it's awesome. By the way, no, this is not HDMI cable. This is actually connected to my power bank. And to prove more, I'm gonna show you that we are actually live. And you can see me, wait a minute, there you go. You can, you can, you can see me, wait, wait, there you go. <laughs> you can see me recording right next to it. And if I move this, you can actually see it's moving. And you can do tons on this. Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Riz and today's exciting video, I'm gonna show you how you can connect any iPhone to any TV without Wi-Fi. And to do this, you might ask, this thing, this thing is absolutely awesome. I don't know if you can hear me, but this thing is an HDMI wireless transmitter kit. Whoo, that's a, yeah, that's a big name. But so what it does basically, you'll get these things. You, go, you get two of them. So basically one goes right into your TV, this will go into the TV and this will plug right into your iPhone. And you don't need any Wi-Fi. you can do this anywhere, even if you're in a holiday, which is pretty awesome. Now you might be asking, Rizzy, there is no, there is, how, how, are you gonna, how are you gonna put this thing inside the iPhone? Now, to do this, we'll be using an adapter. I've got solutions to pretty much everything. By the way, all the Amazon links will be in the description box below, so everything you need will be in the description box below, so be sure to check it out. Let's just dive right into it. All right, so first up, as I said before, there's no Wi-Fi connected, so we're gonna we're not gonna be using any Wi-Fi. First up, we're gonna we're gonna be connecting this thing into our TV. It's pretty simple. All you have to do is this is basically HDMI cable. All you have to do is just plug it in. Now, to power this thing, it's really simple. Again, get a USB cable. Get a USB cable. Plug this USB inside your TV and plug the other end into into the into the transmitter. So what I'm gonna do is just hold this thing. All you have to do is just plug the charging kit into this thing, there you go. And that's pretty much it. Now, all these things will be in the description box below, so be sure to check it out, okay? Now let's plug this thing into the TV and let's do this. Okay, so I've plugged in the transmitter. Now to activate this, it's really simple, all you have to do is any TV, by the way, doesn't matter what TV I have, or it doesn't matter what TV you have, this will work with literally anything you have. Now, to do this, you wanna go into the sources. Now, sources is basically where you'll get the HDMI connection or USB connections. In this case, as you can see, that is my HDMI cable. Let me just go into the HDMI cable right there. All you have to do is just click on it. Once you click on it, we'll give you this a receiver kit or anything like that, something like that. This is basically a transmitter screen that is showing me that I have connected my transmitter to my TV. Now I have to connect my receiver to a phone or a laptop or it doesn't matter anything. So now to do this, we're going to be putting this thing into our iPhone. Again, it doesn't matter what iPhone you have. It really doesn't matter. Okay. And all the Amazon links will be in the description box, description box below. So be sure to check it out. Now let's put this thing into the iPhone and let's do this. Okay. So first up, we're going to be putting this, the HDMI cable into an ad adapter. Basically, we cannot put it directly into the iPhone because it doesn't do that. Everything you need will be in the description box below. All the Amazon links will be in the description box below, so be sure to check it out. Okay, so we have installed it and it looks pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, you can actually you can actually tape this if you want to. Not going to do that, but yeah, let's just <laughs> yeah, let's just move on. Okay, so got the iPhone got the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look weird at all, honestly. So just plug this thing in. There you go. Okay, so make sure it's tight. Now, once it's plugged in, you really don't have to do anything. Now, we really need to power this thing up. Now, to do this, you might have to use a power bank or you, actually, you can actually use a dual connection tip from your iPhone, but I would not recommend it because I don't want this thing to drink all the juice from my iPhone. So. In this case, what I'll do, I've plugged in the connection to the adapter. Now let's just put this thing into the adapter and fire this thing up. Pretty simple, got the power. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is basically put it in front of you so you can actually see how it works, okay? So let's just do that. Let me just put this thing, there you go. It should be powered on. Let me, let me see, let me see. Yeah, it's blinking. If it's blinking, that means it's working. So that's pretty good. Now, once it's connected, all you have to do is just unlock your iPhone. Once you unlock it, it's connected. There you go. So, so simple and it's so cool. By the way, you have to make sure the connection, 
you have to make sure the connection is stable, okay? If the USB is not put in correctly, this will do that, okay? So let me just fix things, fix this up. Let me show you how it's done, okay? So make sure first up is connection this one. This one is pretty, pretty steady. Next one is gonna be this connection. So make sure it's tidy. So let me just put this thing right there. Okay, so pretty cool. Now, as you can see, we're connected. Pretty awesome, and you can do tons on this, by the way. Again, you can play games if you want to. So let me just fire up something you can actually see and enjoy, and all the sound will be coming from the TV. So let me see if I can find a game or something. So let me just go to the Clash Royale. You can actually see, if the game is full screen, this will go full screen. Again, I told you the sound will be coming from the TV and I don't have internet connection. That's why I'm not, I cannot play it. I told you we don't have internet connection and it's it, and it's it, you can see it on the TV that we don't have any internet connection at the moment so I cannot play it but yeah you, you get the idea right let me just let me just open up clash of clans so you can actually see there you go it's actually it will go full screen you can yeah it's it will go full screen and it's pretty cool so I cannot show you anything because I'm not connected to internet. I don't want to connect my iPhone to internet, but you can do tons. You can listen to music. Let me show you. Let me see if I have some. All right, so I don't have much offline, so let me just tap on. You can see the audio. You can see the audio is coming from the TV. It's so cool. So that's pretty much it. All you have, and if you want to disconnect, you don't have to do anything on your iPhone. Just plug this thing right out and it will automatically disconnect. So let me just show you. There you go. Pretty. Pretty awesome. And if you want to do this again, all you have to do is just put this thing, put this thing back in. Once you put it in, it just give it a couple seconds and we should be connected. There you go. Pretty awesome, right? Well, I'm Riz. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed it a lot, okay? I, I'm expecting a subscribe. I'm expecting you to subscribe to the channel if you find this video helpful. And if you need any help, just comment down below. I'll definitely help you out. I'm Riz and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.